Um, I'm Chen Yu Kang. I attend Drexel. I'm from Taiwan. Uh, not a big fan of American food. So the American food are too oily, sometimes too salty or too sweet, and it just doesn't have the right taste. Um, like I'm not familiar with this taste, maybe, but just feels something is missing or wrong, and that's why I prefer cooking myself rather than going out and eat. At 13th Street, there is a very big um, market. Well, I usually take the blue line, um, the sub, and uh, that's usually what I do. Um, sometimes, if I like, I'm really rushed, I'll take Uber. But most of the time, I'll just take the blue line. So it's it's a uh, it's um, running terminal and. It's basically a bunch of stands combined in one. It's an indoor place and they sell food and a lot of groceries there. And I usually go get meat, vegetables, um, sometimes um, cooking materials. And yeah, they have very, they have very good price there. Um, the vegetables there are pretty cheap comparing to um, other grocery stores. Um, I went to Trader Joe's once and yeah, it's a bit more expensive. And I would also go to um, Chinatown for groceries because there is just some stuff that you can't get besides Chinese stores. And there is McDonald's, Burger King, some other fast food. Um, yeah. Sometimes I'll be um, down for some pizza or burger or fries. Um, but it's very situational. Um, I usually don't eat those, but sometimes I just feel like I have to eat those. I'll eat them. If comparing to McDonald's in the US and the McDonald's in Taiwan, I feel the McDonald's in Taiwan are, the space are cleaner. They look a little bit fancier because the packaging is better. Um, and they use, the McDonald's in my country usually have more than just one floor. It's two or three floors. Generally, if you eat outside, in the US, it's more expensive if you want to like actually have better food. It's too expensive and yeah, the, sometimes if you don't go to like a somehow like decent restaurant, um, they don't serve food that's too good and the restaurant's not that clean also. Um, in Taiwan, the people the service there is really good when I first compare it to US because they ask like extra questions like do you need like extra extra things sometimes here if you go to a better restaurant here um yes they also ask you the same question but if you go to the same amount of level of restaurant um compared in Taiwan and in US it doesn't really happen so yeah, you just have to pay more here, so... <laughs> Actually, our family... Uh, my mom is more special. He, she knows how to cook a lot. Um, I know a lot of my friends' parents, they don't really cook. But um, my mom... Cooking is like a hobby for her, so she taught me how to cook a lot. And my uncle, um, he's actually Irish. And he is a professional cook for a lot of hotels. Um, he worked in like W, uh, Mario, those hotels. And he's a restaurant consultant right now. And yeah, um, he cooked a lot and that ex 
inspired me to cook a lot also. Mm. So generally, um, it's it depends what I cook. Sometimes I cook um, very fancy stuff. Then it takes actually takes time because sometimes I feel like it. So those stuff I tend to do it in the weekends and. If I have a lot of class that day, usually I don't cook because I just can't, don't have the time. But if I don't have too much class that day, I'll usually cook at least dinner. And I'll just try something that's not too time consuming. I cooked um, for some, some of my friends before and once or twice my roommate and my girlfriend. Sometimes I'll make something more fancy and then that's not healthy, but besides that, most of the time it's healthy. <laughs>